Hi, how is everyone? My name is Dante Ramos with Black Film and TV. Hi, Dante Ramos. Hi. <laughs> it's nice to meet you guys. So I'm going to start off first with Logan. I feel that the focal point of this season was the art of letting go. How do you personally practice the art of letting go? Wow, I love that. Um, I Number one, uh, honor Marie Kondo and Shintoism. I mean, that is literally the art of letting go. And I, I mean, you can see, I, I used to not be this minimal. I used to be way more, I mean, there's junk on the other side of this camera, don't get me wrong. But, um, <laughs> but I think that for me, the art of letting go is like appreciating what you have. And I think that, uh, that I have appreciated this show, this, this journey. Um, and yeah, I think that's how I, I, Look at it. Yes. And for you, John, I feel like very much in this show, you were having to stand on your own two feet, no matter what anybody else said, especially in this season. So have you ever personally went through a moment where you had to stand in your truth, despite what the outside voices were saying? Uh, yeah, sure. <laughs> in what moment? Oh, no, 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 no. It's not just one moment. Oh, <laughs> many moments. <laughs> I think, but I, to me, like, you know, I think that's just an aspect of just being a person, you know, mm -hmm. I think it's really important that we follow our instincts and we're open to, uh, to, to, to let things in, but you kind of have to stay true to yourself. You know, Gabe's a lot, very, very different than me. He makes mm -hmm. a lot of decisions that I would not have made, which made it fun to play because it was kind of like, well, dude, come on, please, please just don't do the thing. And then he does the thing. Which is fine because some people do the thing and people need to like see someone go through the stuff in order to like learn from it. But no, I think it's, um, I, I, I think what the show has helped me become better at is being present and be when I'm around people, uh, listening to them and having the discussions and uh, I'm very open. I think just in general, like I like the collaborativeness, but you just really have to stay true to yourself as long as you're not like hurting people or making things, you know, I think there's a, there's a balance between being true to yourself and being selfish too. You know? Yes. So, uh, you know, that's, I that's like my response. I like that. And for, for you, Logan, I, I have to say life was living for Sam this season. Overall, do you feel like your, your character succeeded or failed at the end of the day? Um, I think that uh, Sam's journey I think she's successful and doesn't know how successful she is. Like many of us, you know, we're always chasing and climbing, trying to get that next best thing. But if, if she were to take a step outside of her shoes, she could see how truly fortunate and, and truly successful she is. But I think a lot of times our success is measured by what we want for ourselves. You know, it doesn't matter what other people think. They look in, into you and they go, you have this, you've achieved that. And you're like, yes, but I want this other thing. Um, so I, I think Sam is successful. I think she just doesn't realize it. Uh, beautiful response. Thank you guys so much. And congratulations to a season finale. Thank you so much. Thank you. Take care.